One last question. It's going to be from our producer, Adam Lewis. Uh, we, we were putting together a little, tr- little trivia, and, and Adam's going to ask us this one question to see, see what we got here. We, we all know that Duncan's a basketball historian, if just listening to the Long Shot podcast in the past. So we're going to, uh, we're going to kick it over to Adam. We had, yeah, we had a couple questions lined up, but we're going to push it back. We'll have to have you on in the future for like a straight trivia episode or something. Um, I love that. I, I picked a, <laughs> a specific question that's really um, like specific to you and Cole and how you came up and how you were now made the NBA. So this is a question for all three of you, and I guess which, whichever one of you gets closest um, to the correct answer is, is going to win this week's trivia challenge. Uh, how many active NBA players played for multiple colleges? So they had to play for multiple colleges and then make the NBA and like play uh, active right now. Um, and this is between 471 active players this season. Who wants to lead us off here? Pat, Patty's usually not good at, at uh, answering these questions, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go with Patty to go with the opposite direction. Um, no, I'll start. What you just said was just patently false, but <laughs> 471. Um, I'm going to go with the old head thing here. I'm going to say that uh, with the transfer portal and all that bullshit now, it's probably higher than I think it is. So I'm going to say 65. Yeah, no, I think that's actually a, a pretty good. I think it might be a little higher, though. I think I th- I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with 74. All right. I mean, I between international players, um, one and duns. I mean, yeah. If I were to take a stab, you said seventy four. You said sixty five. Is that what I heard? I said sixty five. Yeah. Yeah. What What'd you say, Cole? Seventy four. I'm gonna take. I'm going to take the under. I'm going to go 64, and I'm going to box out Patty. So Patty's in a, <laughs> yeah. t- right. Patty's in a <laughs> tough spot yeah. here, but I'm going to take 64. I'm going to take the under. So I, I basically get everything beneath it. So what do we got, Adam? Yeah, so the a- answer is actually much lower than what you guys thought. It's only 41, um, Fuck. which is I interesting. I 47. I was going to try and go with 10%. It's almost exactly 10% is, is what I was going to say. And I'll also say that going through, like I had to delete the players that – might still be in the G League, but were like played a game last year. There's like a bunch of them, in- including like, um, I mean, there's just a bunch of names. So, so it's lower this year than it's been in the past. And now, obviously, with the transfer so portal, I, it's going to go well. I think Duncan. Yeah, won. Duncan wins. Damn. Wait, Adam, Adam, did you crunch these numbers yourself, or did you like pull this from a trivia set? Yeah, so I pulled the. I mean, there, I I had did have all five thousand players on a spreadsheet at one point, and then I just like slowly got it down to. Um, the the numbers that had multiple colleges, five thousand. Yeah, all time. And then I took oh, active, and then I took. Oh shit! This is serious. What the Patty. hell? I take my job serious. So. Yeah, Adam, like your stuff I, dialed in, and I appreciate it. I did have like six more fantastic trivia questions, but uh, I mean, give me one play. more. Give me one more. I mean, I'm undefeated, but right. let me let me this, get one This is more. a good one. This is more personal then. <laughs> We'll do uh, stay on the college topic. So on the Heat current active roster, we've got three pairs of players that played for the same college um, at one time or another. So you can try to name all three or you can just name one. The, the original question was going to be name one, but there's three answers to this question. So an example would be like, I mean, I don't want to give it away, but whatever, just two players. Go ahead, like, Bam, Bam, like Bam and Tyler. Bam, Bam and Tyler, Tyler both played at Kentucky. Perfect. There's one. Can you guys yeah. get the other two? On our team? Yep. Cole and Kyle. That's another one. Uh, I mean, this UCLA, Kevin and Jaime. That's right. There you go. So that one's Dude, that one Adam, we got to we gotta do something better than this. Right. I mean, that's low-hanging fruit, guy. Come on. Yeah. Can we add, like, are we going to ask where my coworkers went to college next, and then they can lose <laughs> this, that question? Because, I mean, if you think about it, we were going to do it, like, private. So you wouldn't have gotten to work together, and someone would have screwed one up or forgotten something. So it was supposed to be a trap game, but that's all right. We'll go, all right. Uh, Adam. That'd be Adam, a tough look if players on Adam, the Heat were. I just want to let you know who you're dealing with. At one point in my <laughs> life, when I was at Williams, I could name every single NBA player and where they went to college. And I, I'm, I can't do it anymore because there's like maybe some obscure players that 
like young guys that I just don't know where they played at college because I stopped following. But I used to be dialed in to where players went to college. I just want to let you know that as we move forward because we're going to do one more. I am 2-0 and undefeated. But if I go 3-0, and then we're done. I'm calling All it right. right. Duncan tied the most three-point shots made in an NBA Finals game. Um, how many was it, and then who was he tied with? That's that not too, fair. Is that too easy? That's not fair. Come on. Duncan, is it too easy? Yeah, it should Duncan. be for me and Cole. I mean, you guys can take a stab at this. Yeah, but that's not, not the best. Listen, there was some that Patty that's would get more. not the best hosting if we're not allowing the guests to answer. <laughs> I mean, is that too easy, Duncan? I can, I can go... I mean, I think. I mean, I know I've hit. I know I've hit eight, and I'm. I would guess Steph Curry's also hit eight. Um, I mean, I I had seven, so that's crazy. I I don't know. Um, oh, I had. Was it seven? I think it was seven. Yeah, it was twenty six. You know who tied that? It was seven. Steph is Danny Green and Steph both have hit seven. Would be my guess. I don't think either of them have hit seven, according to my research. Um, it's a fellow Heat player. I'll give you that. Not Ray. Uh. Shane Batty. Nope. Similar year, though. Mike Miller? Mike Miller is right. Damn. Let's go. My next guess. All right, give me one more. Oh, no. All right. I can't go out like that. Give me one more. So, all time, Miami Heat um, win the highest team they have against a win percentage against and the lowest um, win percentage against also. So, so give, me, give me the team they've beaten the most and the team they've beaten the least all time. Well, so that's not the question, Patty. Or sorry, not Patty. Adam, you said win percentage, not the team they've beaten the most. Those are two different things. So which one is it? Beaten the most percentage of times. So so yeah, give me the percentage. percentage okay. And you can guess the percentage. Too. Right. That was going to be a second question. Uh, I I have no shot of percentage. I'll say beaten the most. Let's say Charlotte. So I was just going to say that. Whether that be Hornets or Bobcats. Uh, it is not Charlotte. Any other guesses? I'm gonna get up the list to see where Charlotte is, but okay, I'm gonna go with because it's gotta be the same division. Let, let's let's yeah. just throw the Wa- Washington Wizards out there. Yeah, the, the Wizards is correct. Formerly known as the, that's a good that's a good the shot. Formerly known as the as as the Bullets. That's, that's a good that's a good that's a good guess, Cole. Do you have any guess at, at how many times out of a hundred they win? I'm going to go 68%. Yeah, that's I was going to say 65. That's crazy. It's uh, 67.4% of the time they win. Wow. <laughs> wow. Cole's down. <laughs> Good shit. I pulled that one for sure. All right. I got least, though. Least is definitely San Antonio. That's not what this is. It's uh, the trail. All right. Somebody else guess. Somebody. Oh, shit. Oh, I'll just say somebody else guess. Uh, it's Portland. It's the Blazers? Yeah. Damn. I wouldn't have gotten there. I would not wow. have gotten there. I don't know how, but I guess that's the situation. It's it's thirty nine percent. That's good stuff. Duncan, yeah. Wait, Duncan, have you been successful at Portland? Uh, yeah, I've won a, a Portland a few times. Uh, yeah, we've we've done all right against Portland since I've been here. It's funny, Duncan always talks about the games that they haven't won. Like we haven't won at Minnesota in forever, right, Duncan? I've never won in Minnesota. It's the only place. Wow. And then, did you win at Golden State? Was this the first time you won at Golden State? No, we won. We won during the pandemic. We won there when they were they were really bad. Uh, when Steph and all those guys were hurt. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. We beat them there. But I mean, yeah, it's uh, Minnesota's only.